Hello, over here. This is Nerd Girl is Um, throughout probably the past week, I've had kind of a revelation. I'm not sure whether what I'm thinking is true or not, or whether I'm just crazy or what, but, um, if there's a possible link between neurological disorders such as Asperger's Syndrome and, uh, diabetes and depression. Now, um, I have all three. Um, I've had Asperger's ever since I was a young kid. Um, I was diagnosed with diabetes. Well, I was d diagnosed with depression whenever I was probably about 14. And, um, diabetes a few months later. So, um, I don't know, just, uh, just a few days ago, um, I really took some time to rest, uh, my body because I was in a car wreck about three months ago and got some severe injuries from that, uh, some, uh, cuts on my, uh, shoulder, uh, and, um, on my elbow and on my stomach that wouldn't heal up at all after three months. They, there was no progress in healing at all. And then I just took a few days to rest and then, um, they started healing up. Um, of course, I started uh, eating a, a lot better those few days. I'm trying to uh, get healthy because I'm about to have mouth surgery in a couple months as well. And um, something weird happened to my brain. The only thing, the only way I can describe it is as my thought process totally changed. It was like before I was thinking with this part of my brain and then suddenly I started thinking with this part of my brain that's the only way I can describe it um over the past few days I've become more sensitive to smells I can smell things that I just that I didn't pick up on before smells are stronger to me taste uh things taste different like they taste clearer like, I can perceive the taste of it a lot easier and a lot stronger than before. Um, I used to be, uh, also very clumsy whenever I walked. I mean, I would, just my, just my way of walking was very distinct, but very, I couldn't balance things well my job. I was a server. I couldn't hold trays as well as some people. I mean, whenever I hold my hand out before, I couldn't keep it straight at all. And now I can. It seems when I walk faster, also. Um, I'm less tired than I used to be. Um, I don't know if that's because I sleep a lot more now, but I just seem less tired. I, uh... I can calculate math better. Like, I can, um, do calculations in my head that I just, if you'd asked me before to calculate two numbers together, I couldn't do it in my head. And now, I'm able to a lot better. Um, this all over the past few days. Um, I'm able to perceive people's emotions a lot better. Um... The only way I can describe that is, like, if I was even watching just a movie or something like that, I can pick up on the character's intentions a lot better. I haven't had much time to go out in the real world and talk to many people, because I've been kind of, um, alarmed by this and kind of trying to discover exactly what's happening to my brain, what's happening to me neurologically. I don't know. Um... I don't know if my brain patterns have changed. I don't know if my brain is growing, maybe. I just, I don't know what it is. And so I'm looking out here, maybe on the online community. Maybe maybe some of you can help me discover what's going on, really, in my brain before I go to a neurologist. Because I really can't afford that. But, um, yeah, it's really weird discovering. It's like everything I do, I'm experiencing it, experiencing it in a new way. Um, especially with eating things. It's, it's amazing. I just didn't, 
I just didn't perceive it the same way before. Um. So yeah, if y'all any if anyone knows anything about the links, maybe between these diseases or um, disorders, and maybe the uh, what's happening to my brain. Um, y'all could post some stuff down in there in the comment section, and of course I'll be posting some more updates on my denture vlog and stuff like that, but, um, also maybe some more stuff about my Asperger syndrome and depression and diabetes and stuff like that, but, um, yeah, if y'all go ahead and maybe comment on this and help me a little bit, um, I would really appreciate it. Thanks. Goodbye. <laughs>